Good evening. The final Saturday of 2019 featured a loaded college football schedule, including a wild one at the Cotton Bowl in Dallas, Texas. Number 10, Penn State, taking on number 17, Memphis. A total of 92 points were scored at AT&T Stadium. Opening quarter, Penn State down 3-0, but not any longer. Meadville grad Journey Brown ripping off a 32-yard touchdown run. Penn State in front 7-3. We'll skip to the second quarter now. Lions up 21-13. It's Brown showing off his speed again. And this time covering 56 yards and a score. He finished the day with 202 yards on the ground and two scores. Lions up 35-23 at the break. On to the third quarter. The turning point of the contest, 38-36 in favor of Penn State. Micah Parsons provides the pressure, creates the ball-jarring fumble. Garrett Taylor was able to pick it up and score. One final chance for Memphis, but Marquise Wilson steps in the way, gets the interception. Penn State wins a wild one, 53-39. Parsons and Brown named defensive and offensive MVPs, respectively. With more, here's Peter Terpstra. The confetti didn't settle for very long. They are already tearing up the turf here at AT&T Stadium, getting ready for the Cowboys game coming up on Sunday. Penn State wins the Cotton Bowl. It wasn't pretty at all times, but it's going to be a happy flight home. Hey, hey, hey. Both teams ran up the score, but only one team ran the rock. Penn State running back Journey Brown is your offensive MVP with 202 yards and two touchdowns. I told people no, I'm just not fast. I've been telling people this all the time. So, I mean, just for me to be able to show it and uh, finally get uh, proof, I guess you could say, that I'm, I'm, a, I'm a, a balanced back, all-around back. Uh, this feels good. I don't know if that was exactly how we planned it out, um, that's for sure, but uh, we, were, we were having our way up front, and, uh, you know, when, when offensive linemen, thank you, when offensive linemen are telling you, you know, run the ball, run the ball, we're moving them, we're moving them, you know, I'm not going to say no. The defense got burned at times, but it was a pick six by senior Garrett Taylor in his last game that gave Penn State a boost. Their offense was making plays. Um, we did a good job of holding them to some field goals sometimes, but we knew we were going to have to get a turnover, a takeaway, uh, points on D to do something to you know, change the game. I think it was going to come down to the team who had a defensive stop, uh, defensive turnover, and we got one, one late when we needed it, and we ended up finishing with one. So, real great, real momentum changer. That's 11 wins, and the season is over. Now we look ahead to next year, and Penn State hopes it can become a college football playoff contender. Reporting from AT&T Stadium in Arlington, Peter Terpstra, Fortnite. Nation.